Hello and welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new. We are back at Kohl's, finally. Are you ready? Let's shop. So today we're going to see all the new items, of course, spring, summer, lots of 4th of July sprinkled everywhere around the store at this point, and some kitchenware, all the things as usual. So yes, back at Kohl's, I actually went back to the post that I did a few weeks ago when we were still looking at Easter items and I asked, do you guys want me to do an Easter Kohl's video? It had 108 thumbs up. This is in the community tab. I posted it. And 18 comments. Out of the 18 comments, only eight said yes to do it. The thumbs up though, I would think means that you guys would want to see it. Last time I did a Kohl's video, it was super controversial because I personally, didn't love it i didn't think the quality was the best so let me know what you think do you guys like cole's videos do you like their products this little guy right here was actually fairly heavy it was a lot heavier than i thought it was going to be um so yeah let me know in the comments how do you feel about cole's i can tell you from the last cole's video which was back during christmas time it was insane like everyone was just like either they love it or they don't and actually some people said that there are some inconsistencies there like a love hate relationship i never did the easter one because when i came in here they barely had any easter items so that's why that video never happened but today when i walked in here i saw quite a few things that i found interesting just like these little stars right here. These are one of my favorite things I saw in here today. Love, so good. This wreath, also really good. I really, really like that. So yeah, I figured, yes, this is worth doing a store walkthrough. So here it is. But don't forget to let me know in the comments your thoughts. Do you love Kohl's or do you not love Kohl's? Or are you indifferent about it? Now here is this wall of all of the 4th of July items. I was actually surprised that they had so many already, but I guess that's, you know, Easter's done with and now we gotta move on to the next, right? That's how it usually goes. That wreath right there with the little stars and the, um, the little berries, love it. This bow, it lights up. Really, really cute. I'm really loving this section like i really love all of the fourth of july items that they have going on i was actually very impressed by that love the star i love stars i love stars some of you that have probably been here since you know back in um christmas time in december probably know that already this little red truck y'all it's the little red truck love the bow with the you know flag print on there i thought that was so so cute love that the fact that they added the bow is doing it for me with the little red truck back on the scene <laughs> and then here is some of these um spring summer items i almost want to say this is like already moving on to summer it's um the lemon tree not lemon <laughs> the orange tree it's really cute i really like it by the way, I'm showing you the little screens so that you could see what the sales are and what the price points are. When I tried to look at the actual item, I started to find that a lot of them did not have the actual prices on there, which is why I figured, you know what? Let me just show you the little screen. That way you also see what the sale price actually is as well. It doesn't mean that all of them don't have prices. Some of them do, but not all this little chair is the cutest thing how cute is that and you see it has that little clip so i think it's maybe for a place setting or maybe even a picture but it's super cute this one super light not heavy at all love this lantern so good the whole wood tone situation 
love this plant i thought was really nice also and i really liked that the little pebbles and such that they used i like how they used that color one and also they're tiny they're like super tiny the other ones that i've seen i believe it was like big lots and another place but the few others that we've seen the actual stones that they used were dark and i really like that those are light now moving on to some doormats favorite one is coming up right here well actually both i really like the bicycle so cute right so good and then here is another truck if i could get it out now here's a little blue truck i actually like the bicycle better super cute but these were my two favorites Now moving on to the throw pillows. These are the, like the super summery ones right here, themed out, beach home vibes. And then I figured we should check out what's happening over here. This price right here is pretty much, if you see it there for the faux suede ones. I thought this one was really cool. Love the pattern. And look, it's nice and soft. You can do the chop in the middle. And then, of course, you just saw right there, they also have the flag one. Like I said, lots of, um, you know, Independence Day decor sprinkled throughout the store. Some of these I'm not a fan of, I have to admit, I was not loving most of these over here. This one right here is not like as good as the other one like you saw, like it didn't really, you couldn't do the choppy chop on that one. These I really liked. You can't really do the chop in the middle, but I love the buttons. That detail makes up for it and I thought these were very nice. more of the coastal beachy vibes over here i like that one that says um tropical getaways how do you guys feel about throw pillows i mean where does one store all of these throw pillows right like i really want some for all the holidays of course but i'm always like where am i gonna put them so doing the um what is it called it's not a pillowcase but you know what i mean the let me know in the comments what is the word i'm thinking of i know some of you are yelling it at the screen right now i love this little bird one i thought that was cute and so is this bicycle one both of these love what is it called you know what i mean but anyways those the little <laughs> the the pillowcase for the throw pillow i can't think of the word um that would make more sense right but then you see all these cute ones at all these stores and I want to buy the actual pillow. I can never figure it out. Of course, here are some of the beach towels. They're all $15. I thought some of the prints were really cute. I really loved the watermelon one. And then look guys, we were just at Costco last video. I will link it if you have not seen it and you're interested, but I thought it was so cool that they had all these items some of them that we saw already at costco so perfect to kind of compare compare and contrast compare and contrast as i like to say just to see like where the price points um are at right like why not you gotta shop around and see who has the better price i personally don't think that anybody can beat costco it is my favorite. I always feel like they give you the better item, the better, I mean, you can't compare quality per se because if it's the same brand it is, but usually Costco has the one with like the more gadgets or the more whatever it may be, you know? So I do love Costco. This little guy right here, I wanted to show you because I actually own one of these. I got it at, um, on Amazon 
and I think it's so cute and I didn't realize Kohl's sold it. So here it is. Colt Classic, George Foreman. Raise your hand if you owned a George Foreman grill. What? Everyone did. Am I right? Maybe some of us even, I don't anymore, but I did at one point. So let me know, Do you did you ever own one or do you actually even own one right now? I didn't realize those were still out here. <laughs> now here are all of these Food Network items. I didn't know this. See, because I don't necessarily shop at Kohl's. Like, I don't peruse Kohl's like that. I did during Christmas because, of course, I needed to see all of the Christmas items. And then I went in there for Easter and I didn't see anything, which is why the video never happened. OMG, guys, EVOO. EVOO. Rachel Ray. Yes, I used to love watching her on the Food, Net Food Network. And please let me know. I, that's how I discovered EVOO, like how to say, like to say it that way. And at first she would be like EVOO, EVOO. And I'm like, what is she talking about? And then extra virgin olive oil, what? Yes, she definitely was the one who taught me EVOO for sure. So good. But anyways, I digress. OMG, I almost forgot what I was talking about. I didn't know Kohl's carried like the entire Food Network collection. And by the way, they feel like really good quality. I know the Rachel Ray stuff. I've heard people say that it is good quality, but the rest of it seemed to be nice. Like nice, dirty, heavy, all the things. Some of the things that we discussed in the Costco video. Here are some of the knives with the little um, wood thing that I was talking about and I agree just like some of you most of the people that commented in the Costco video on whether or not I should get the wood block with the and have the knives on the counter said to take it off the counter and I agree because that's what I was leaning towards like why I don't even have that much space to begin with so might as well keep it in the drawer now here are all of these dinnerware sets so good this one right here reminded me a little bit of the one that we were looking at at costco and it's all food network i was impressed i had no idea but now we know now i know you guys probably already knew but if you didn't now you know as well this all white one i actually really like I think it's nice that it has like the design on there, but it's all white. Super cute. The buy one, get one half off too is not bad at all. Because like I said, again, it's this is like such a comparable video to the Costco one just because we saw so many of this like similar items. But buy one get one and like I said in the other video I would need like three and, and not I need them I need three sets only because that's what I prefer um these are the ones I have now like similar very similar Corel for sure and it's white with that like black little swiggy swag but it's a little bit different not exactly the same and let me tell you I got them many many years ago but I did get them from the Corel store itself back in New York and they were not a hundred and whatever that just said I forgot already what it said they were like $55 per set you know and that's when I started my obsession with having three sets of dishes because it gives you 12 of everything and that's what we're used to now so to me any new sets that I get I have to have 12 plates 12 bowls like that's what we're used to so i need to have all the things all the plates and that's that <laughs> but look at this you can't get away from the food network items and again i will say it again they're good i'm very impressed love this 
it reminded me of something similar that we saw at um, World Market. Very nice. OMG, look at this. I couldn't wait to show you this. How good is this? Three cake platters in one? Three serving platters? I thought that was really good. I love it. And it's clear glass, goes with all the things. Anything that you have going on, it goes. Love. Now here we're back into the whole summer vibes. This is so cute, love these. Look at the back one, the second one. The little flip-flops, so, so cute. That first one right there, the first one that I was just looking at, totally reminds me of like such a Mexican vibe, like vacation, so good. This Hello Summer one, also so cute, love. Then we're going patriotic again. They have a bunch of those. Love the one with the flag. How cute is that one? So good. So as you could see, it's safe to say that I was actually very happy that I finally did peruse around and gave Kohl's a little bit of a chance to see what they had. And they didn't disappoint. I mean, I was trying to give them a chance for Easter, but they just, my particular store just did not have anything in there. It was so not worth actually doing a video in there. There was nothing to show you really. Love this one with the star. We already said, I love a star. So cute. So again, this time around, they did have plenty to show you, which I was very happy about. I hope you're liking it. Let me know in the comments, definitely. What did you think? Did you see anything you like? Anything you're wanting to get? And like I said at the beginning, let me know how you feel about Kohl's. Right now, Kohl's is doing it. I'm not upset with them. And I will definitely give it another chance and come back again and see maybe what they have for the next season see what's going on this section right here love too i thought these glasses were really cool very nice lots of like melamine outdoor platters and such very nice And then I almost thought, like, I almost, I didn't see this. So I was just like, hold up, there's more. But wait, there's more. More 4th of July patriotic items, of course, for all of the barbecues. They have got it all. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, yeah, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. I almost forgot what I need to say. But you guys know, right? Give it a thumbs up subscribe if you haven't click the notification bell so you won't miss any of my videos share the videos with your friends that really helps so so much i'll see you guys in the next one bye